There's a Mario encyclopedia coming. It's gonna have all kinds of great details. Got whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't report about that. Report about my pop tart deal. Three dollars, sixteen. I gave you some, so. Fuck off! Pop tarts are good, actually. You should eat them. Well, now you can't have any. Cameron's Pop-Tarts are not important, but the Mario Encyclopedia is. It sounds really awesome, just like the, uh, the Legend of Zelda ones they did. You get all kinds of fun details about enemies and power-ups and all kinds of stuff like that. And I would love to have that. It sounds like an amazing coffee table book, just hanging out in the living room, checking it out, and being like, whoa, that's where the Hammer Bros came from. Isn't that neat? Just great. It's gonna have uh, super detailed stuff about every game, where all the secrets are, stars, etc., coins, everything. It's gonna even talk about glitches, all kinds of stuff. And it's only going to span from 1985 to 2015. Mario Odyssey did not make the cutoff, sadly. But I'm sure they'll make another revised version later. We'll see. But uh, it sounds really neat uh, and interesting. I bet it's going to be awesome. It's over 250 pages long. So it's a fucking huge book. Can't wait to check that out. I will definitely light it on fire. We finally got a release date for Mega Man Legacy Collection 1 and 2 on the Switch. And it's May 22nd. Uh, we've had it out on other consoles for a while now. And they've been like... We're, it's coming to Switch for sure, it's coming. But we finally, they said, here it is, this is the date, get ready. Um, I don't know how exciting that is, because like I said, it's been out for a while on the other consoles. And we've had Mega Man Legacy Collection 1 on, uh, on 3DS and other stuff for a long time as well, so, you know, whatever. But uh, it's gonna have a little discount if you wanna buy uh, digital only. You're gonna save five bucks, it's $15 for the first one, $20 for the second one if you buy digital. But if you buy physical, it's a bundle of both of them for 40. So finally, some type of incentive to buy digital. Usually digital games are the same fucking price, which doesn't make any sense. It's like, what am I? Okay, so if I buy physical, I have the game in my hands. I can sell it and make money back and everything. But if I have digital, there's no benefit and I'm paying the exact same price. They're giving us a little incentive, which is nice. Uh, I probably won't get this because I don't really give a fuck about Mega Man Legacy Collection 1 and 2. It's whatever. You can find those games everywhere. Whatever. But Cameron likes Mega Man a lot, so he'll probably buy it again. I'll buy it. Naked. <laughs> oh, I can't hear that. I heard it. It's those vintners. I'm having the vit fits. <laughs> Fail Overflow on Twitter recently shut off. They got Linux fully running on the Switch. They're, they were over there browsing Twitter, looking at all kinds of stuff like, check it out, it's running, there it is. Uh, they're not telling anybody how they're doing it at the moment, but they do say that with the Switch's current console state as it is, uh, that the current model of the Switch, uh, that e Nintendo can't stop it. They said it cannot be patched, so I don't know, Nintendo hates people hacking their stuff. I'm sure they're gonna try, but these guys say, nope, mm -mm. I don't know who would know more, these hackers or Nintendo, probably these hackers, because like that's their fucking thing, right? I don't know. But uh, I'm sure Nintendo might be able to put some kind of thing in there where they're like, oh, your console's bricked, oops, if you do Linux, who knows. But uh, we're gonna get a new version of the Switch, obviously, we get a new version of every console, so it'll be fixed by then, and I guess these guys are gonna have to try again. But for the time being, that's kind of neat for people that are into that kind of weird stuff. I don't care. I would never try to do that to my Switch because I have a fucking PC. I don't need to do that. It's okay. And in some movie news, you guys know I like movies, so here you go. Black Panther recently had the biggest February release of all time. It broke over 200 million over this uh, past four day weekend. A Deadpool last year on a four day uh, weekend did a, hundred, oh, a little over 150 million. So Black Panther blew that out of the water and it's actually the fifth biggest film release of all time right behind three Star Wars movies and the Avengers. So that's pretty fucking good. Black Panther was amazing. If you like Marvel, you're gonna fucking love it, obviously. If you like movies, you're probably gonna like it. I don't know how you wouldn't like this movie. Uh, maybe you're racist, but if you, sh if you are, you shouldn't be going to the movies. You should stay in your house and never come out. But uh, I don't know, check out my vlog if you wanna see me and Karen and uh, our friends. We went to see Black Panther and we give you our little thoughts on it. And we said, you know what? This is a fun time. Maybe you want to see us go watch a movie. I don't fucking know. We, I yell at Cameron in it. So that's, and if you like that, then go check it out. I it's thought, Bubby and, what? I thought it was the sixth highest grossing movie of all time behind the magical sunglasses of Dubai. That's our movie. We made that. Well, I thought that was number one. We didn't get him. <laughs> we didn't get any money off of that, Cameron. It was on Google Video. Hmm. It was on Google Video. I thought it was in theaters. No. Nope. You shut your fucking mouth and just make sure the camera's yeah. straight. What? Fucking bark! But yeah, check out Bubby and Friends if you want some fun vlog stuff, some extra stuff after this. It's a fun time, right? And if you guys really like us, if you want to go above and beyond and be just the best people in the world, hit up our Patreon for as low as a dollar a month. We had someone ask about a $25 
tier if we could add another one we're thinking about it but you know we, we have a limited amount of stuff to give away we have to restock on stuff to give away we send out boxes to our 25 dollars tier patrons and we're about to send the first box out soon whenever the money goes through we get the first payments from that and you guys are gonna like those boxes but we might add another one we're not sure we're thinking about it we just need to make sure we can get more stuff so there's that but if you guys have any other ideas for other tiers we have we have an idea for a tier let me throw this one out there see what you think a ten dollar tier where we send out personalized letters to each patron with a instax uh photo which is a polaroid basically it's a fujifilm polaroid and uh camera's gonna bring me a picture right now or he's gonna show you a picture uh you can tell us what kind of picture you want maybe you want to see camera nude we can take one of those and send it to you just kidding no nudes nothing sexual but maybe you want to see cameron reading a book in the library we got milkshakes we, we got mario we, we can do got... that so hit us up if you guys think that's a cool idea for a tier let us know and we can we get, we'll get that one up there for you guys and as always if you like the video leave a like if you didn't leave a like anyways and if you're gonna dislike it just because i said like it you should like it anyways because you're a dick and we need more dicks on this channel we need people yelling at us and saying this sucks why am i watching this please be that guy but anyways we need more dicks on this channel okay cameron will you fucking move get that <sighs> okay where was i oh yeah and if you're new here hit the subscribe button and if you keep coming back to the videos and you don't want to subscribe because you fucking hate us, but for some reason you keep coming back, subscribe because you're learning to like us. I see it in your eyes. I see it in your, the, the twinkle in your eyes. It's just like, you're going you're gonna to be there. You're going to be there soon. So hit it up. So I want to say thank you to your loyalty. Thank you for your support. And fuck you. Thank you. Bye.